What's up guys and welcome back to my channel! So it has been a while. Actually been a long time. Actually a really really long time. And just to give you an update of what's been going on, because I haven't seen you guys in so long over here, if you want to catch up with our everyday life, we've still been putting out videos and vlogs um, every week, go check out the description below. I'll leave some links to our channel as well as Joey's channel. She's been putting up a few new videos as well if you're into some of the girly things too. But, it's just good to see you guys. I actually got a new camera as well, it's an A5000. Um, some of my videos in the past have shown on iPhones or uh, on our T3i. This is kind of our new uh, camera we're giving a go. We really like it so far, sorry if I look up once in a while, because there's actually a screen I can see myself pretty well. Um, and it seems to be awesome, it's only our second day having it, but I've loved it so far. It's going to be able to let us do a few more things we've wanted to do and haven't been able to, and also just give us a nice second camera to have around the house. Which is really cool for when we go to the parks, when we want to vlog, when we want to do a couple of different things, uh, we'll have it on hand. As well, since we've been gone over on our vlogging channel, we've hit almost 2,500 subscribers. Super pumped about that. Over 200 here on this channel somehow. I don't even know how because I haven't uploaded any videos. So thank you guys for that. I'm still trying to toy around with the idea of what to do with this channel, if that kind of makes sense. Um, I still want to do things kind of how I've done in the past. Um, be able to talk about some comics, talk about some nerdy-ish things. I know in the past I've done a couple of different like comic book reviews, but I haven't really stuck with it. Uh, just putting so much time back in the day of vlogging channel and still doing that, but kind of now understanding how to do things and it doesn't take up as much time. Um, so I want to kind of get back in the flow on this channel as well. Uh, something cool that's come out recently, I've only got issue two because I found issue two at the parks, haven't been able to get issue one, but Haunted Mansion. Uh, new Marvel series that they're doing um, Something cool as well. If you see this little symbol up here Get that to focus there um, That's a Disney Parks exclusive variant cover Which is something they've been doing recently to give exclusive covers to the parks, which is really cool They started with Vader Down issue number one um, as well as they're doing it for Haunted Mansion I really need to pick up issue one um, and then I have issue two and then pick up three because I think that's already out or about to come out Something like that, but they sell it at Memento Mori if you're in Magic Kingdom It's a new gift shop dedicated to Haunted Mansion right outside of Haunted Mansion kind of across from Columbia Harbor House But apart from all the updates, it's great to see you guys and we're here to do this We're here to open a blaster box of Star Wars Force Awakens Boom So you can pick these up at Target. Sometimes the Target doesn't always have them um, luckily one close to us had some in stock. I've been saving this actually for the new camera to come in to be able to open it up They had series two of the cards They've already had series one come through and then they had the big journey to the force awakens set um, That were kind of made in that kind of retro cardboard feel to it So definitely some cool sets. I've already been out. I really like these sets I've opened a couple of packs up in the past just to check them out uh, Each one of these boxes is guaranteed to contain a medallion card so I'll show you what that looks like in a minute. That'll be the last thing we open because it's kind of fun to see what you got. Um, but yeah, without further ado, let's open some cards. All right, guys, there they are. Let's hop in. Ten packs plus a medallion card. Let's see what we got. I'll try to make these nice and fast. That's not to bore you. But if you're one of the people like myself that enjoys even watching videos of people opening things, I won't go too fast. Sometimes it's fun just to watch. There's a medallion card. One card inside, I can tell it's really thick. Um, so we'll save that for last, because that's always fun. If you really want to, you can skip to the end and see it. But here's 10 packs, let's go. First pack. All right. So we got them arriving at Maz's castle, Perilous Departure. Ooh, Captain Phasma character sticker. That's cool. Jump to light speed. Ooh, it's a hollow foil. So, I was actually hoping we'd see one of these. Um, you see how that one is kind of like the regular, kind of metallic at the bottom? If that makes sense? And this one, if the light hits it just right, See that there you go. You kind of see the rainbow to it. Um, that's one of the hollow foils, so they're um, a rarer, more rare, whatever the phrasing that would be. Um, they're a more rare 
parallel for the card. So I'll set that to that side. Got Flame Trooper. Power of the First Order. Very cool cards. I like those. I like the setup of those. And then Ray's Awakening. Or spoiler alert, she can use the Force. That's uh, a green parallel. Pack number two. A, a perfect shot. I love that part in the movie. Cannon jams up. I have to flip it upside down. Super cool. Ray on her speeder. Look, I got a little speeder jump drive. Captain Phasma makes her rounds. A duel of Ray and Kylo Ren. They're in the blue parallel. That's cool. Is that a concept art? Yep. Number eight of nine. Nine different concept arts. That's really cool. Got Kylo looking very ominous. And then trapped by Kylo Ren. Dun, dun, dun. Oh. Trapped by Kylo Ren. Sorry if it's jumping around a little bit. Still learning to use this camera. It autofocuses really well, like actively autofocuses, like that. If I don't have actively something in front of it constantly. And then it's really good about jumping back into focus for what's ever in front of it. So let's do this. I'll do this. So it's like that. Oh, that's in front of it. Oh, look. So is that. All right. Captain Phasma leads the attack. Kylo Ren enraged. Enraged indeed. He's not happy. I have General Hux. First Order sticker. Like I said, I like the stickers a lot. Ooh, C-3PO. Here's the resistance. There's 16 of those. And a purple parallel. Finn ignites the lightsaber. And then green, waiting in anticipation. Next pack. Lone Survivor. Finn with the wreckage of the TIE Fighter. Chase through the ship graveyard right before that perfect shot card happens. Very cool scene. Preparing for the worst. The blue. Got the Herod 327 card. I think it's a Maz's. Yeah. Maz's Castle cards. There's nine of those. Ooh, and then Supreme Leader Snoke. I haven't seen this card yet. Power of the First Order. Kind of like that Flame Trooper earlier we had. Very cool. I haven't seen any Snoke cards before. Um, another filler card that gives you a code on Star Wars Card Trader. I uh, got a couple of these in the past, so. You know what? There you go. There's a code. First person to use it, have a free code. If you haven't downloaded it, Star Wars Card Trader. Very fun. Gets you some digital cards. And then Finn arranges an exit. Talking there with Captain Nathano. With a green parallel. And on to the next one. We have Han springs into action. They're on the ship. First order rallies on Star Killer base. Right before they blow up a whole system. Force of surrender. They're in Maz's castle wreckage. Got a Ray character sticker. Very cool. Admiral Akbar. It's a trap. It's kind of like the here's the resistant C3PO card we had a minute ago. And green, the Rathars are free. You don't want to end up on the wrong end of a Rathar. All right. Let Han and Leia say goodbye in this next pack. Finn and Rey reunited. Now blue, the First Order in pursuit. I love those TIE Fighter Pilots costumes. Dr. Kalania, if that's how you pronounce it, I'm not really sure. Here's the resistance card. This, oh, this is a cool card. First, let's see, fleeing the first order, we'll go ahead and get that one out of the way. 
green one there. Really cool scene on Jak Jakku. Look at this one. I'm guessing this is concept art. Yep, first order TIE fighter pilot. That is really cool. I like that card. It's all super dark. You can see a good angle from there. Really cool. Really cool concept art. I like the concept art cards a whole lot. I like them from the last series. I like them from the old series. Definitely one of my favorites. We've got the Resistance Exceeds. Base card there. Castle's Colorful Guest. Love the scene of Maz's castle. I wish like there was an extended scene, which, you know, maybe they'll release one day. Maybe they're going to bring other stuff back. It was like the new Cantina. Got a sticker Stormtrooper. Very cool. That purple Kylo Ren's arrival. Very ominous there as well. We have, yes. Okay, I'll go ahead and back at Nima Outpost there on Jakku VV8. This is cool. This is one of the, oh, let me let it focus. Very cool. One of the poster cards. There are five different poster cards that they used the posters from the promotional content from the movie and there is rays so apparently that's like a one in 24 pack um odds so not the easiest ones to get i guess per se certainly not the hardest ones to pull but that's really cool i haven't had any of those yet um ever so that's probably the coolest card we have so far as far as my favorite that and the concept art one but that's definitely the hardest card to get so far with that we've Snagged. All right. So there's the next pack. We have Jump to Light Speed. Same card as earlier that we had the Hollow Foil of. Right here. You see one kind of just as regular foil. One's kind of that rainbow effect. Gives you a good show. Piloting the Millennium Falcon. That's a cool picture. Getting some taking some blaster fire. BB. Eight follows Ray home. It looks like a little misprint there. If you can see right there on home. Interesting. Some people go after those. If you're one of those people and you happen to see this, shoot me a message. We can trade some stuff. That's kind of cool. I like I like when stuff messes up sometimes. It looks like the bees misprinted too. So that's kind of cool. I'm going to set this one aside. That's interesting. We have Kratinus. I don't know how to pronounce his name. But that's one of the other Maz's Castle cards, which I think those are cool. Um, definitely, like I said, really cool scene in the movie. Kylo Ren, there being super imposing with the power of the First Order card. We have another Tops digital download code. I'm going to set that one for myself. And the Greedy Unkar Loot. Never really know how to pronounce his last name correctly. That's a green one as well. That one's actually got a little bit of a mess up on the printing too, maybe. And it was not a good day at the printers, apparently. Alright, only two packs left, and then our medallion card. We're close, guys. We are close. Alright. FN2187 fires back. Cool one there, Finn. Tortured by Kylo Ren there with Poe. Kylo reading some minds back there. Kylo Ren's power. A lot of Kylo Ren cards here recently. Stopping that blaster bolt in midair. Something I super freaked out about when that happened. That was really cool. We have a Leia sticker there. And our character stickers. Heroes of the Resistance Ray card there. Add those to her friends. And then we have a green FN 2187's Conflict. That's when his fellow stormtrooper got killed there. Last pack, Han Solo and Chewie return home. Chewie, we are home. Defining moment there in the movie. They use for promos and everything. Super cool to watch. General Hux's grand speech right before they blew up the Hosnian system. RIP Hosnian system. Ray is captured. BB-8 gets away. There on Jakku. Blue variant. Very cool 
Snow Trooper concept art. Like I said, I really like these concept art cards a whole lot. I actually think I already have this one from a previous pack and back when these first came out. But a really cool card. That's the third concept art we've had today. And then certain, last but certainly not least, a village invaded there to the beginning of the movie. All the stormtroopers piling in. All right, guys. Those are the cards so far. Let me know in the comments below. What was your favorite card we pulled so far? Mine would probably have to be the Ray poster. I haven't seen any of those in person yet. I've seen pictures. People I know that collect. And I think it's super cool. Someone's probably going to have to go up on my shelf. I just like putting a few cards I like up on the shelf once in a while. But the moment you've been waiting for, as have I. A medallion card. Bum, ba, da, da. We have a Poe Dameron. I believe this is bronze. It's a bronze one. It says number five of medallion cards. And the medallion is the finalizer. That's cool. I like the finalizer medallion. So Poe. Like I said, they have different rarities. So there's bronze, silver, gold, and platinum, I believe. Um, I'll show you this one I got in the past. I have a ray. I believe it's a silver. So you have Poe, and this one's actually numbered. It says ray, number 119 out of 350. So that's the definitive number one, and it's got ray speeder. And you have Poe here, not numbered, still very cool, with a finalizer there. She got aboard after he got captured. Um, so yeah, there's a medallion card for this one. There you have it, guys. I hope you had as much fun watching that as I did opening those. I love opening the packs. Um, although we didn't get a numbered medallion, still super cool. Uh, it's only the second one I've ever gotten. So if you happen to be watching this and like to trade, shoot me a message, leave it in the comments, something like that. Um, I'm sure we can trade something because I... I'm just doing this for fun because I really enjoy it and I hope you enjoyed watching it. And if you like what you saw today, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss another video. Uh, I probably won't be here all the time because still putting a lot of work into the vlogging channel, but it's something I like to do and I definitely want to sit down with you guys once in a while and do something fun like that. Maybe answer some questions, maybe go over some more comic books. Let me know what you want to see. What do you want to watch? Um, what do you like? I'm always open to suggestions and also trying and finding new things that other people enjoy as well. So leave me a comment below and let me know what you're into, what I should check out, or what you want to see next. And like I said before, if you want to keep up with me a little bit closer, check out the vlogging channel link below. Head on over there, give us a look. Also go check out Joey's channel. I'll leave that below in the comments as well. So until next time, guys, I hope you have a fantastic day. Take care of yourself and others. And I'm going to try to figure out this... Uh, camera a little bit better. Mm, better.